Hello and welcome everyone. I am Mundante Musk and I am bringing to you a concert review of Gorilla Toss. And yes, they came live to the Outer Space Ballroom and it was great. It was definitely great. Now I know you're expecting Caspa. I know you're expecting the Panther, but I am here because I know about post-punk. What better guy than me to talk about post-punk? Them, they don't really know about post-punk like that, but I do. So, due to this fitting the genre, Gorilla Toss came and they definitely conquered. I feel like Cassie really brought a great performance to the show. Her stage presence has a lot of personality, a lot of quirkiness to uh, her moves as well. She really knows how to draw in a crowd. She really knows how to control it. And Ariane did a great job on guitar. Zach did a great job on bass. And Peter did an excellent job being the multi-instrumentalist genius that he is on the keyboard. And it was great how the lights really coalesced well with the instrumentation, with everything. So it really brought it in key, really brought that experience. And the energy was amazing. Everyone looked like they were having a great time. Uh, these two guys in the front row, they were like really getting into it. They were like rocking back and forth. And everyone was really having a good time. But they seemed really, really into it. I was into it as well. I was like jumping up and down and just like really feeling the energy. So what they did was they pretty much performed a bunch of new songs, old songs, off um, from their GT Ultra, even all the way back to, they play, played a little bit of the vintage stuff too. But yeah, I had a great time. Um, I definitely encourage you to get into Gorilla Toss if you haven't already. If you haven't even heard, check out GT Ultra. Check out Famously Alive, their new one. Great stuff, great stuff. And th there was a tragic part of the night, and that tragic part of the night is when I was going to buy some merch, but I didn't have Venmo. I needed Venmo, and uh, I didn't have that app. And my phone was over full, and I didn't know about the trash feature, and yeah, it, it was just bad. But if you are watching this, if you are watching this, best believe I will definitely collect some merch. Merch will be purchased by yours truly, Muntante. So, yeah, that's basically all I had to say for that. Great show, great instrumentation, great performance, and they even did a cover at the end of Velvet Underground's All Tomorrow's Parties. Absolutely killed it, and it really gave me an aha moment because it kind of vocally gave me the feeling that Nico is a strong influence on Cassie. So, there, there's even more appreciation for, for them now. Because not only are they great, but they also pay homage to the legends, but do it well. If you're going to pay homage to the legends, do it well. And thank you. Thank you for bringing that style back. Thank you for nuancing it and putting your creative twist on it because it was great. And I look forward to more of your albums and possibly a Famous Alive album review will come soon. So it is I, Muntante Musk, and I will return because I don't lie like some people we know when they enter big rooms. I'm pretty much on the political side, so you, you may know where I'm coming from with this. But yes, I will return. Gorilla Toss, Muntante, keep doing it. Keep going. Till next time.